Hey, y'all, she girl, are you ex? Are you seen? It's a book of the pro it's a scripture in the book of Proverbs that says, Don't let your good be evil spoken of. And I'm saying this because earlier today, and I mean this for you and everything and testing, like earlier today, I was at the playground and I seen this little girl, she was playing with this little young black boy. And she was playing with him, saying, I'm running from you because you are a criminal. God must have put it, because, you know, God, children belong to God. God must have put a spirit in him to where he just ignored that little girl. Like, they was playing. They was running hard back and forth. Once he said, I want, she said, I'm going to play criminal and you the criminal. He turned around. He just started playing with his sister because, you know, I think, I believe that was God for him to have enough knowledge to stop playing with her. Um, why don't you allow people to speak over your life and over your children's life? You got to plead the blood of Jesus and rebuke stuff because words have power. We don't wrestle against flesh and blood and the, we, we have spirit, the, the gift of life and death inside of our tongues. So you can't sit here and be allowing people to say anything about you or anything about your children because stuff, when people say it jokingly, it, it tends to attach itself to things and, you know, bring itself to life. So be careful what you let people speak over yourself and your children. Is your girl already, ex already saying, do what you got to do for you.